For our fifth and final stencil technique, we're actually going to be combining a few different mediums to create our end result. So I am using one of the gel plates uh, for gel printing. Some people call it mono printing. Um, there is a three pack that you can get from Ranger that has three different assorted sizes. Um, it has a small circle and then two rectangular shaped ones. Um, so you can use them for all sorts of different things, but it's kind of a gelatinous sort of um, surface that you can use. Now you see that I put down some Dina Wakely acrylic paint to begin with. Um, that just gives me a base coat. Usually you're going to want to put down some paint first, pull a print, that's what it's called when you put your paper down onto the gel press and then pull it off. It lifts the paint or whatever medium you're using right off of the gel uh, plate and you get that transfer onto your paper. You can use any kind of paper for this like printer paper, cardstock, whatever you want to use is totally fine. Um, then you go ahead and lay your stencil uh, we'll put another color of paint down, lay your stencil down, and then pull the print on the same piece of paper that you already put that original coat of color on. So we started with our turquoise from Dina Wakely, then I put the black ink down, put the stencil over top, and then you can see that it only puts that black ink where the holes from the stencil came through. Gives you a really, really cool print. Now, you can also do what's called a ghost print. So here I'm just drying off the gel plate a little bit to make sure that my paint is nice and dry. Um, you can do this, like let it dry by itself while you're cleaning your stencil off, um, or whatever you want to do. Then I'm going to go back in with that um, turquoise acrylic paint and put a layer over top of it. Now because the bottom layer is dry, it won't mix the paint. They will just layer on top of one another. So now we've got turquoise paint on top of the black, but when you pull the print, you put that paper down on it and pull the print off, it actually reverses it. So the turquoise is on the bottom and the black is on the top. So you get a totally different result with what's called a ghost print.